I'm very lucky that my grandmother, who is over 100 years, is still alive. I cannot imagine what this lady thought when she started looking for money. A lady who has never had any formal education to look for money and send me to school. So it's that foresight of that old woman in a village who recognized that education is key to the development of Africa. Women are the, f uh, the first in charge of uh, educating the children. And so if the women are not well educated, they, it will be hard for them to really train their children and the future, um, you know, the outsprings and, you know, to, to, to lead to development. The youth and the children needs lots of care from their mother, so the mother really need to be well educated. But we also just need skills. It's a right of human beings to reach their full potential. We need to do training, higher education, science, technology and innovation for women as well as men. And I was even more excited to uh, see that uh, the number of women uh, trained in the program has increased from 4% when they started today to 48% of those that have been trained are women. And these are tremendous amount of achievements. Uh, when the DG for the, our institution called me and said, so we got a scholarship for you, you have to go at Makere to do your studies, your MSc studies. Uh, that time I was pregnant, I told him that I will not go because I knew that most of scholarship, they don't allow woman who has a baby or who, who are pregnant. So Professor Dipara have suggested that I have to go. I went at Makerere with eight month pregnancy. In one month, I, deliv I delivered. So Professor Adipara, he paid the, the money for the ho from the hospital. They take care for me with the baby. They gave me, they gave me a new house. They shifted me where I, I was staying when I was like a single. Because I had a baby with a maid, they gave me another, another uh, nice house. Uh, it, is, it is important to have a woman in science, you know. Uh, actually, in Burundi, most even in all countries, women are more than 50%. Meaning that the woman is the key driver for agriculture. It's a great space for women because my major goal is to make sure that I, I, I contribute to the improved livelihood of rural women in, in Malawi and Africa. Reform, every time I look at a reform post, I feel part of reform. It means a lot in the sense that it's part of my history now. Forum has helped me as a person because they have helped me in capacity building during my funding my master's program and also after the master's program I had the opportunity of being involved in the CAP project. So I think it has helped a lot, especially in the capacity building and improving my skills. To us, really, we are saying that we are married to the forum. Why? We are, we are bringing the science and putting it together with the, our knowledge, our local knowledge. So once we fuse it together, then they can take it back to the lab and write papers, and they, we call it our research together. So we really don't call them partners. We really say that we are married now. It's a good marriage between us and the forum. <laughs>